respond to what you guys know? Um, yes, it's okay. Uh, but maybe just I'll, I'll stay here until you. Okay. Um, do you happen to maybe give us a small update about uh, yesterday and what you're doing today? Oh, okay. So uh, yesterday I I was actually uh, trying to today because we had uh, submission for uh, our interview uh, technical interview this is today so i was actually uh, finishing up the documentation i would send and the the, the technical uh, questions or challenge was supposed to be submitted with github also so i was i was actually working on that uh, last night so Basically, that was all what I've been doing. I'll be submitting today. Okay. Um, okay. I I wish you all the best with that. And I think yeah, you it's okay you may you may leave now. Thanks for sharing your update. Um, okay. okay. So, so yeah. Sorry? Power is here. I, I I was just saying that. Thank you. Okay. So. Um. Okay. So let's start with the others. Today's stand up. We're just going to do our regular daily check in on what you thought about yesterday's sessions, um, and what you found useful about yesterday's sessions and what you're going to do today and if you have any questions or if you have any possible interviews coming up um yeah so anyone willing to start Um, maybe we start with Abraham. Do you want to share your updates? Um, Abraham, do you know it gets started? Okay, um, seems he's not available now. Can we move to Bethlehem? Good morning. Okay, good morning, everyone. So, yesterday was mostly an introduction to Lee. I think that's a good platform that's going to be introduced. It will be very useful to us in our applications and adjusting our CVs and application later to different companies. Um, and I've also been looking into my projects and trying to improve some of them. I've also started to work on some. And that's mostly what I did yesterday. Uh, so I don't have much update, I think. Thank you.
Um, I think we lost. you well when you what what you were working on yesterday can you guys hear me yes we can did you hear what Bethlehem said or was it just from my side uh, I've heard like mostly, but it's it was cut off. Okay. Um, okay. Um, Bethlehem, if you can hear us, uh, we didn't hear you quite well, especially when from the part where you said today you'll mostly be working on. If you can please repeat. Okay, sorry about that. So what I was trying to say is I'm I want to improve on my past project. So I've started uh, doing something and that's also what I'll be doing. So that was what you missed, I think. Okay, yeah, I think that's what I missed. And I think it's great that you're also working on improving your projects for as you get ready for application phase. Thank you for sharing. Um, we can go to the next one. Um, if you want to go first, you can also just raise your hand. If not, we're going to just... Okay, yes, Mr. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, so yesterday, uh, just like we told him, uh, I went back to old project, uh, week three challenge, which was the redash. I wasn't very confident about my submission at the time, so I'm taking a look at it and trying to do it from scratch again. So that's what I'm doing. Um, that's also very great. Um, and again, if you encounter any challenges, there are always your fellow trainees or your tutors um, who can help you through it. Um, yeah, that's great. Um, anyone else wants to volunteer to go next? I'm not sure if Abraham Teka is back. Can you hear us? If yes, could you um, could you share with us um, what you're up to, what you th what you thought about yesterday? Um, yeah. If he's not back, we can go to Daisy. Good morning. What have you been up to? Uh, hello, good morning, everyone. Yesterday's session was interesting, the one with Yababel. I can't wait to use Leap. I think I will figure out how to use it more the more I use it when I'm actually using it. And yeah, yesterday was a busy day for me. Yeah. yeah, so been working on the project that I got and yeah, that one has been keeping me busy and today I can't wait to start using Leap. So I and also I was wondering um, when we get updates on that. Can we get the updates on this stand up? Updates on when you when you're going to use when you're going to start using Leap or? Yes. Um, okay, I'll inquire that and then I'll make sure you have your feedback before the end of this stand-up. Okay, thanks. I'm happy to hear that you're happy, uh, you're very interested in LEAP. Um, shall we move to the next? Um, Henok can speak right now. But yesterday he was watching some Python tutorials and trying to upskill. Um, that's great. Um, 
uh, we can move to Jabez. Uh, what's your update? Good morning. Uh, <clears throat> yesterday I was uh, also doing the uh, task given after the interview. So uh, last night I was doing that. Uh, hopefully I will submit today by, uh, by the before the deadline. Uh, that's it. What that's all what I was doing. Okay, um, all the best with your submission. Um, how confident are you with the work you've done so far in regards to the interview? Yeah, it, um, it is good. Yeah. Also tell us uh, what you've learned through the interview process that you'd wish others would know. Uh, I think uh, the overall, uh, the, the task that, that I am working on is good and I think uh, it, it will prove uh, uh, what we have did uh, the, the last three months. And also for the interview part, uh, it was good. One of the, thing, the new things I learned through this process is the poetry. It's, uh, it's like a dependency management uh and i we didn't use it before uh, and i, I had not i had uh, no experience with it but it was easier and uh, uh and it was good so that's that, that's what that is one thing i was asked in the interview uh but i i, I tell him that i didn't know about it but now when the challenge comes it, uh, it it was asked to do that using poetry so i learned this new thing Okay, that's great to hear. Um, and I hope that also, and I'm also glad to hear that the work that you've been doing the past three months has given you a good base for you preparing for your interview. That's great. Um, thanks for sharing. Um, if maybe just to add on that, are the trainees aware of what kind of projects you were given for the interview? Have you ever shared it before? Yes, we shared it on Slack. It's a uh, rag uh, optimization uh, task. It, it is the same kind of project that we have been doing. Uh, it's just some. It's not. It's not a new thing, uh, but we have to, I think, prove, uh, and we have to provide a good quality code. That's all. But it's not a new thing. Okay, um, that's great. Uh, I hope the others are also looking at the challenge and also getting um, ready for the interviews. Thanks for sharing. Uh, we can move to Michael. Good morning. And what have you been up to? Michael, can you hear us? Are you able to speak? If you're able to speak, um, put a thumbs up. If you're not able to speak, thumbs down. And we can wait for your update and message. OK, uh, maybe just type your updates on on the chat. Uh, we can go to the next one. Um, Salam Awit, good morning. What have you been up to? Good morning. Can you hear me? Okay, so um, yesterday, oh, I'm sorry. Yesterday, I was um, um, my computer's charger was not working, so I had to get that fixed. So that took me almost half a day, and then um, I tried to join the leap introduction uh, sessions. So I was able to see some parts of it, and it's very interesting, and I'm looking forward to actually being able to use it. 
uh, Blue Worker said it best, it's like TikTok for jobs. Um, it really simplifies the whole process of job searching. It looks like it, so I'm excited to be able to use that. And other than that, um, tend like yesterday night, I was working on like seeing the projects that I was lacking in and trying to regroup. So I was trying to create a list of projects that I'm, I want to actually go over and do again. So that was what I was up to. Um, thanks for the update. It's great to hear that you're upskilling. And I love how the phrase that you've used on Leap, it's TikTok for jobs. Um, that's a good catch. Thanks. That's um, a good term. <laughs> Okay, um, so uh, Michael says yesterday he was reading about Loop and connected with people on LinkedIn. That's great. It would also be nice to hear what type of people or uh, the connections that you thought or how you got you went through the connections on LinkedIn. Uh, if you if you can share more. Thanks for your update anyways. Um, so we have Thomas again next. Um, good morning and what have you been up to? Hi, uh, good morning everybody. Uh, so uh, I was, yesterday I was going through my projects and uh, trying to like trying to collect uh certifications i was exploring on genetic ai and machine learning application and trainings just to explore more more topics and uh, more on my projects i was working on uh it was in interesting and uh, we appreciate the time in the effort going to the, the project and it actually really is helpful. It is somehow uh, confusing with going to search for jobs from LinkedIn and other uh, platforms. So this this will help us a lot. So that that's that's cool and I'm looking forward to the to it. Uh, I'm working on my projects and yeah, organizing all my materials. Um, thank you for your update. And this is Margaret. I don't think I sound like Yabeba. Um, I think you can choose that. Um, but thanks for your update. It's great to hear that you're also upskilling. Um, that's great. Uh, we can move to Johannes. Good morning. What's your update? Good morning, everyone. So yesterday session on LIP was uh, great and they made me excited on the next job surface. And I connected with uh, some, some people on LinkedIn. Uh, I focused on uh, people from Ethiopia and trying to get information on the company if there is an open position on machine learning. And for today, I'm not sure because power is out currently and it was out all day yesterday too. But if it comes back on, uh, I'm planning to um planning to apply to more jobs uh, until we get access to leap. Okay, um, that's also a great initiative. Um, thanks for sharing, and I'm sorry about your uh, the power going on and off. I hope it gets steady. Um, so I, I think I've seen others joining now. So we have Joseph and Mark Buba. I think we haven't heard from you. Also, Jerusalem and also abraham tekka so if you guys can if any of you can just unmute and tell us what you've been working on what you thought about clip um that would be great
Maybe we can start with Joseph, then Mahbuba, then Ayurisola. Um, uh, morning. Can I can I give my uh, feedback in five minutes because I'm on the road right now? Okay. Okay. That's fine. No worries. Um, in the meantime, we can go to hmm, Mahbuba. Just left. Ayurisola. Are you able to give us uh, feedback or updates on what you've been working on and what you think about it? Um, Jerusalem, if you can hear us, uh, thumbs up if you can't, if you can speak, thumbs up if you can't, um, thumbs down, then we'll wait for your update on chat. Okay, um, so while we wait for Joseph, Abraham is reading about SFIA. I'm also applying for jobs in LinkedIn. That's great. I'm not sure I understand what SFIA is, but okay. uh, regarding, the, oh, yeah. Uh, Daisy had asked about when you'll start using LIP and the team has said they're working hard to make it available for everyone and they will be announcing soon uh, when it's available so dates are not so clear yet. Um, okay, so we have... I'm seeing Hilary just joined. Okay, Joseph, you ready? You can go ahead. Yes. Um. Good morning. So, um, for for me, how I'm taking, um, approaching this phase is trying to just be consistent. Uh, uh, just like the technical phase. However, this phase I think just requires a different kind of consistency, uh, especially as now we're approaching uh week one of application application phase. So um, I understand that the bare minimum is 50, 50 jobs per week. So um, yesterday, at least, um, I could spot like four jobs um, that I can apply for. So I'm trying to do at least 10 in a day, such that it does not become such an overdrug. However, I'm still behind by at least six jobs. However, I'm also now just waiting on leap and trying to see if um, I can use it to the best um, capabilities yeah, of the job search. Thank you. Um, thanks, thanks for your updates. And I also love the mindset that you have regarding uh, the job. Job search, that's great. Um, Johannes, did you raise your hand by mistake or you want to share something? Yeah, maybe a quick update. Uh, I had an interview yesterday and I just got a reply now and they offer me the job, but uh, I'm not entirely sure if I'm going to take the job, but maybe for the rest of the team, uh, I share the link and if you guys want to join the team uh, you can apply to um, um congratulations first of all and thank you so much for that um so why exactly are you not sure that you're going to take the job uh 
uh, it will depend on the the time uh, the requirement time uh, because it's first of all it's unpaid job and it's for three months and since they are in the new stage or in the beginning stage i'm not too confident about the company but if you will take me uh, or if they give me like if i have to apply small amount of time uh, i'm going to take the offer okay um that's great and it makes sense um i think it's i think it's okay yes an academic team. Mm -hmm. uh, so I was going to say, uh, Johannes, completely understand that you are skeptical because it's an unpaid job, but um, also it's good to have like real world experience. So I can say uh, it, the decision is solely up to you, but for me, I would advise that you take up the role go there do not settle on what they have building because startups are always trying to juggle a lot of things but try to find your experience there i can say just take up the role go try to build your experience there as you are also still applying by the way you have to still be active in this phase but go out there and see how you know the real world experience is looking like within that company you may never know it may be the best experience ever so just take up your chances you don't have anything to lose yeah um thanks pascalin that's really good advice and also henok is inquiring what was the role and also maybe uh what the company does the, the role is uh, machine learning intern and the company is uh, working on uh, trying to improve uh, uh, health in uh, uh, India. And they are planning a lot of things like uh, maybe tracking uh, the information of each individual and trying to predict uh, disease uh, and like to trying to uh, suggest some health limited before uh, something bad happens. And as I, the other aim is trying to reduce uh, an error that comes with the uh, medical. And yeah, there's, uh, th they are planning to do a lot of things. I'm not sure if they started yet. That's why um, little, uh, I'm not as sure of the company, that's why. But if they are going to do what they are planning to do, uh, it's a great project, yeah. Okay, that's great. Um, maybe just some follow-up questions on uh, what's the name of the company, where it's located, and where you. How did you apply for it? Um, which which place did you find it? Uh, I found it on LinkedIn. Uh, I just searched on LinkedIn, uh, machine learning, engineering, and uh, filter it to past months, and I found it there. And uh, I shared the details on uh, Slack. It's in India, and the name is Hiles AI. And yeah, maybe one other suggestion I will give for the rest in the interviews, uh, maybe you might not already, try to practice like while talking. Uh, when uh, you are practicing for interview, don't, don't just uh, uh, practice on your head. Uh, I don't know if that makes sense, but yeah. It's, it does make a lot of sense. You might have a lot of things planned in your head, but when you try to speak, um, it's something completely different. And uh, that's a very good advice. Yes, um, you still yeah, want to speak? Not only, yeah, not only that, uh, it will turn your brain on. Like, I was asked a question uh, that I wasn't prepared on, but I was surprised how fast I answered the equation. So yeah, it will make a difference. Um, let's take it. And, uh, I think we can attribute that to muscle memory.
Um, sorry, can you guys hear me? Okay, sorry, my internet dropped from me. So, I recently met and can speak, but she said she had her first interview yesterday and it was great, but she doesn't think she'll accept the job. Mm, she's trying to connect on LinkedIn. Um, I, I don't know if you've shared this already with the team, but if you can, share more about the job, the interview, and why you don't think you will accept the job. Um, if you can share it here, maybe on the Slack um, channel. Uh, yeah, I think we're almost past time. We're already past time. We still haven't heard from Hilary. And also, I think uh, one of our team members, Mariam, won't, will be leaving soon. So we would also want to uh, give her a proper send off. So maybe Hilary can just start first uh, what you've been working on. Good morning, Abraham. Uh, yeah, I've been on. Uh, so for me, I've been working on the challenge I had uh, that I was given as part of the application, and uh, that's what I uh, did yesterday up to now. I'm, I'm just uh, finalizing my things. I'm going to uh, send. Uh, I'm going to submit it soon, and uh, yeah, that's all. Uh, Okay, um, all the best to that. What do you think about the, how confident are you with submitting the challenge? Uh, I'm a little bit confident. I, I implemented some things and I discovered some things I hadn't. And, uh, and I, I, I hope that may give me an edge, but um, uh, I'm also a bit anxious. Uh, about what was really expected and if there were, something was really needed i am i'm i'm anxious that i may not have understood what was required but um uh not to say that i'm less confident but i'm, I'm a bit confident about it okay um if you could please talk to a technical tutor about uh the things you're not so sure of before submission, um, but congratulations anyways. Um, so let's give this chance to Mariam to maybe brief us about, uh, yeah, when she'll be leaving. Mariam, can you, are you able to speak? Um, if you can hear us, thumbs up. If you can speak, thumbs down. Okay. Um, so we can't get to her, but uh, we'll probably be updated very soon and she'll probably get some time to speak with you guys before uh, she leaves. I'm not sure if it's soon this week or next week, um, but yeah. Uh, if anyone has anything else to share. Yeah. Um, Pascal, do you want to share the news? Okay, uh, actually, yeah, I just wanted to clear the air for those who sent, like, you know, sad emojis. Yes, we sad to see her leaving, but yeah, we are also happy for her because she's starting her PhD. She's officially a PhD candidate, so should we, go, should we be going fully into it uh, starting this August? So, yeah, so, so much happy for her. Uh, hopefully, she will send us something uh, in our community channel. Yeah. 
Okay, um, thanks for clearing the air. So, yeah, I hope she'll give us updates soon. Um, uh, otherwise, if is there anything else anyone wants to share something, something not clear? If not, we can end our stand up and let's all have an amazing day. Yeah, okay. Have a great day, everyone. Bye.